We thought we would bring you to this Hummercorp. Oh, that is. Now, it'll be interesting to see what it caught there. We may need to do a little bit of an instant replay, because it definitely did catch and eat something there. It could have been a frog or a small fish. And I just find it fascinating the way they can use their toes to detect movement and then coordinate their beak fast enough to actually catch whatever it is they've disturbed with their toes. I mean, it's absolutely remarkable how quick they are. Incredible hunters. Oh, oh, I mean, it had two strikes within a split second there. But missed whatever it was. Oh, there goes another thing. I think they're little frogs that it's feeding on. That's my guess, but there's only going to be one way to find out for certain, and that's to slow it down a bit. What happened there? It's, it's just so hard to say, see what it's eating. Either way, it's having a successful morning foraging for breakfast, that's for certain. These birds are not only fascinating hunters, they build one of the largest nests out of all the African birds often two meters cubed. It's not unlikely for them to gather that many sticks. And they actually have a burrow into the center of that huge, huge clump of sticks. And other birds often nest on top of theirs. So if you ever see a very, very large clump of twigs in a tree when you're driving through the African wilderness, you can be almost certain that this is the engineer of it. Ooh. Here it goes again. It seems, judging by its body language, that it is feeling lucky. Why and how it can sense something there to change its behavior, I'm not too sure. Looks like it may have fallen asleep now, mid-hunt. Not dissimilar to Leopards, that often happens with leopards. They'll be lying in wait, waiting for their prey to approach them, and next thing you know, they're snoozing. Oh! Jeez, well done, Ferg. To keep up with the, the speed of the Hummercorp is quite something, and you were on that. But it was a failed attempt. There's a crow calling in the distance. I can't see where it is, and you may be able to hear it squawking as well. Well, it seems like we did arrive at a good time to at least see this Hummercorp doing its business. It seems like it acquired enough to eat in the short time that we were sitting there to have a bit of a breather. What a beautiful scene that is. Magical. Okay, well, seeing as the things seem to have quietened down here, we were, as I said that, it took another stab. Um, let's just watch. It seems to be, it seems to be getting going again. Let's see if, let's see if we can't see it. Show us its skills one more time before we head on. Now the girls in final control are trying to work out what it is exactly that it is catching. <laughs> 